What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is the free general collective reading, Path to Side to Everybody in Between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is flu fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um, I got a channel in, so I decided to share it. It's a free general reading, so only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, a masculine energy illegally, fraudulent, fraudulently put a feminine energy into a false marriage um, against her will. I heard against her will. And of course, if you illegally put somebody in a fraudulent marriage against their will, they obviously did not sign the marriage documents. And you cannot get married. I mean, you cannot force somebody into a marriage. You just can't do that. I mean, this is not slavery times. And that's just the truth. You can't do that. Um, so, anyways, I heard, um, however, he's about to, um, he is planning on surprising, surprising her with divorce papers soon. It is not going to go the way he wants it to go. She is going to um, refuse to sign them and retaliate back against um, against him with a lawsuit. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, and she should, whoever that's for. She should. She should retaliate against him with a lawsuit because she never signed the damn um, divorce papers to begin with. Um, he shouldn't have done what he did. And she's going to be very successful in the end. Very Plus some. Oh my God. Wow. I heard, and she's going to be very successful in the end, plus some. So, plus some. So, I'm assuming she's going to be successful with the lawsuit because I heard she's going. Okay. So, whoever this is for, there's a masculine energy that fraudulently, fraudulently put a femme energy into a false marriage. So, he did some kind of falsification of marriage documents. She never agreed to be in the marriage. I'm assuming there's not even marriage photos. I'm assuming the marriage has never been consummated, meaning they've never had sexual intercourse because she doesn't even know she's in the damn marriage. So how the hell are they even going to have sex if they ain't even, I mean, if they're not together? Because they probably haven't. They most certainly have never had sex. Oh my God. Wow, this is getting, wow, this is getting deep. Quick. Okay. So they most, okay, I heard from Spirit, they, they haven't even had sex. So it wasn't even like a one night stand, a fling, a, um, a third party or a secret relationship for him to go do something chasey to her. He just decided to put her ass in false marriage. It was, probably for money. it was probably for money. I didn't hear that it was, but why else are you going to put somebody in false marriage if it wasn't for money? Just for real, for real. So anyway, so yeah. Um, but I heard they've never even had sex. So she's not even like a secret fling of his. She, he's never even had sex with her. It had to have been for money. It had to have been. But anyway, so he put her in a false marriage, right? So he either frauded her signature or he had somebody else fraud her signature, but she most certainly did not sign the marriage documents. Um, and somehow he acquired it to where it was processed through to where it was some kind of I don't know. Hell, he might have made it himself. I don't know. But she didn't agree to it. I'll tell you that. Um, and so now he has these documents saying they're married. Well, now he wants a divorce. Well, I'm sure he does now he wants it. I'm sure now he wants a divorce. I'm sure he does now. Well, but he doesn't. Have, there's not a divorce to give because she never agreed to the marriage. He needs to be in the middle hospital. And I'm serious about that. That's screwed up in the head. Just for real, for real. It just really, really is. Um, so, and I don't say that lightly about people just needing to go to the mental hospital. I'm serious. If you go through that great of lengths to put somebody in a false marriage, there's, there's screws, like, they're not loose. They're hanging off up there. And I'm serious about that. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Okay, I heard someone's getting a huge wake-up call. I'm serious about that. I'm serious. They're not loose. They're hanging off. Um, so anyway, so I heard he's, he's planning on soon surprising her with divorce papers in the mail soon. So in snail mail is what I'm presuming. I'm assuming it's not email 
I heard in the mail. It could be email for some of you guys, but for a lot of you guys, I feel it's snail mail. Um, but I heard it's going to backfire. It's going to backfire on him. She is going to refuse to sign the document. So if you're the fem energy in this situation, we have the masculine energy to put the fem energy in the fraudulent marriage and the fem energy in the fraudulent marriage, but it's not a real marriage anyway. Just hell, y'all haven't even had sex, man. Just saying, just saying. Um, but I heard she's going to refuse to sign them, which absolutely, yeah, yeah. And it's going to turn into a lawsuit. And I heard she's going to be very successful plus, plus some. So she's going to turn around, refuse to sign the papers, probably take them to a lawyer, explain to a lawyer what the hell is going on, and then turn around and sue his ass. That's exactly what I would do. And that's a, that's just the truth. That's exactly what the freak I would do. Kudos to whoever you are, Fem Energy, that's about to do this. Because this is some shasty ass shit. It just is, is, is. Let me see if I hear anything else. This is about to cause a huge amount of chaos. Huge. And this masculine energy is about to be in serious trouble. Serious. Federal level. Soon and quickly. Oh my God. I heard this is about to cause huge, huge chaos and this masculine energy. So this masculine energy that did this to the same energy heard is about to be in serious trouble very soon and very quickly, federal level. So I wonder if he's one of the ones that's about to be, um, that's under investigation with the FBI. Because I've been pulling in some people recently in my inner, uh, in my readings and energetic spaces that are under, some of them know they're invested by, being investigated by the FBI, but some don't. So I wonder if he's one of the ones that's being investigated by the FBI and he doesn't know he is. Um, I heard it's about to cause huge chaos here. Well, he caused huge chaos by starting this shit show. And I'm just being serious here. If he might need to hear this. He caused a huge chaos by sh starting the shit show. St don't start none, there won't be none. And I'm just serious. He started this shit show. They haven't even had sex. So she wasn't even like a secret lover to him. What the hell, man? Screw hanging off. I'm serious. A Leo is getting a huge, huge, huge wake-up call. High vibrational Leo. This high vibrational Leo is about to take some great action. They have been blackmailed in the past not to. They're about to. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Wow. Okay, so we have a masculine energy put somebody in a false marriage. We have the fem energy, so you could be this person. I hope to God you're not this person. Hell, you may be. I have a lot of low vibrational people that watch me. Have almost, we're about five people away from 10,500 people. So I have almost 10, five of you guys on here. So you might be this person. You might be this person. You might be this high vibrational Leo. Um, whoever this high vibrational Leo is, whoever you are, sir or ma'am, I heard you're high vibrational. Somehow you're connected in this too. Whoever you are, I didn't hear an occupation. I didn't hear if you're masculine or feminine. I'm not sure who you are. But you have Leo in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, Haven, or Jupiter charts. Whoever you are, sir or ma'am. Um, but you're high vibrational, so you treat people with honesty, trust, respect, loyalty, clarity, etc., etc., etc. It's not about money. It is, vibrations is not about money. It's about how you treat people. Honesty, trust, respect, morals, trust, value, integrity, etc., etc., etc. Heard you're high vibrational. You might be wealthy, you may not be. I don't know, but you are high vibrational. So you believe in treating people with honesty, trust, respect, loyal, um, morals, values, etc. Not putting people in false marriages. I heard you were blackmailed in the past not to say anything, but you're about to step up and say something. So kudos to who you, whoever you are, high vibrational Leo, masculine or femme. Um, for this situation, I'm assuming you're about to stand up for this femme energy or stand up for this situation. Because this is cray cray. Because I would, if I was her, I that's exactly what I would do. Because this is some screwed up crap. It really, really, really is. It is, you guys. It is. I'm sorry for whoever this is for. I know spiritual advisor um, was picking up briefly on um, fraudulent marriages too. Um, but this is some sick crap. I heard she's going to turn. She's going to refuse to sign him, and she's going to turn around and sue his ass. And she should. That's exactly what the hell I would do. And I'm serious. 
I am so serious. Um, I heard he's in, he's about to be in serious trouble on the federal level. Very soon and very quickly. Yeah, I would say so. Probably from the IRS. Probably from the feds. Maybe from both. I'm serious. Some kind of federal level energy. I, I mean, he might be one of the ones under secret investigation. Or it might be IRS. Or it might be both. And I'm serious about that. Mini, 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 Oh my God, you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, wow. Well, good. It's good to, I mean, I don't wish ill upon anybody. Anybody. But in all fairness, this dude did it to himself. He did it to himself. You cannot be in a marriage unless you are mentally competent enough to be in a marriage. And that that's the truth. That's the truth. Um, I mean, it states it on the marriage document. You cannot. You have to be in your sound, right mind and body to even sign a legal marriage document. I heard this fam energy. If this is you, you didn't even sign it. So he must, he did it for a strategic reason, probably for money. But I heard he's about to be in over his head. He's about to be in it over his head. Many shocking series of shame events are going to occur and it's not going to go well for him. So whatever the many shocking series of shame events are, I don't know if it's the feds about to get involved, the IRS about to come after his ass. I hope he goes, it, it sound, this sounds like somebody needs to be locked away in prison. And I'm serious about that. Because his karma is about to come to him. He's about to get sued. He's not about to get a divorce. He's about to get a lawsuit placed on his ass. And I'm serious. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. A Scorpio is getting a huge wake-up call and a Gemini. Okay, I heard a Scorpio and a Gemini is getting a huge wake-up call. So Scorpio and a Gemini is getting a huge wake-up call too. So we have you, High Vibrational Leo, that's about to take great action in this, whoever you are, sir or ma'am. And then I didn't hear if these are low vibrational or high vibrational, but a Scorpio and a Gemini, you could be the Scorpio or the Gemini, getting huge wake-up calls above this. You could have Scorpio or Gemini in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, Behavior, Jupiter charts, whoever you are, Scorpio or Gemini. But maybe you knew about this situation, or maybe you're about to learn about it. I'm not sure. You have to plug yourself in wherever you fit if you do. Um, everybody's on different time and life paths. All right. I love you guys so much. Namaste.